Hey guys, I hope you're all doing really well. So today I'm going to be doing a loungewear haul because who is not living in loungewear right now? <laughs> I was very good for like the first month of lockdown of not buying anything um, and then I just caved and found some really nice bits online. Also this top and skirt that I'm wearing right now are new and I'm oh, obsessed. I will link this set down below too. And we're so lucky in the UK right now because we're having such nice weather. So I'm definitely going to get my use out of this. It's just so comfy. Ah, I love comfort. Comfort is key. And so that's why I'm doing a loungewear haul. <laughs> so the majority of this haul is actually stuff from Brandy Melville, which I didn't think would ship very quickly but it actually came pretty fast um, I've never actually ordered online from Brandy Melville before but I know I love their stuff and pretty much as long as I don't get a dress they normally fit <laughs> like most of their things because they are often one size I don't think their jeans are one size anymore um, but their jeans don't really fit me properly either so they're just a very old fit and then I also have something from Topshop in this haul as well so I really hope you guys enjoy this video at the end of the video I'm also going to show you my DIY tracksuit matching set that I dyed recently so the first thing from Brandy Melville is a pair of pink bubblegum pink joggers and I'm very fussy with the fit of my joggers but these fit so nicely they're not very high waisted but they're actually really flattering they just kind of sit really flat against your stomach which I like I hate it when you have like a bulge or like you know I don't like that and they have pockets in the side which is perfect for your phone and then at the end they've just got cuffed ends um, so yeah first time I wore these I went on a walk with Florence and she went in the muddy puddle and then jumped on me so these went in the wash pretty much straight away. <laughs> Don't wear on a muddy dog walk. It wasn't even muddy, I didn't think it was muddy. It was a hot day and everything was dry except Florence found the only muddy puddle. I feel like the other reason I wanted to buy some more loungewear is because I wanted some that I could kind of wear in the house and out of the house on little walks. Um, ones that didn't look very slobbish, if you know what I mean. Um, so these are definitely okay for leaving the house in. <laughs> Then the next item from Brandy Melville is a sweatshirt and I actually have the hoodie version of this one but I don't often wear hoodies that much because the hood kind of annoys me because I like to have my hair down or if I'm wearing a hoodie it has to be tied up because it just frustrates me. And I love the colour of it so I picked it up in the sweatshirt version and it's just like a super oversized sweatshirt and even this has pockets inside so I feel like I'm gonna get a lot of wear out of this um, after lockdown as well when I go to like swimming or bar class um, because that's super handy having pockets um, and it goes like just past your bum like it's a really nice length often I find with oversized sweatshirts they're way too long and they just make my body look really out of proportion but this one does not I then picked up two little t-shirts from Brandy Melville the first one I couldn't resist because I am just obsessed with everything western and it's a little cowboy t-shirt but I love the colour of it and the little cowboy thing. So I think I'm going to get a lot of wear out of this. I think it would actually go with the skirt I'm wearing today. <clears throat> there you go. Another quarantine outfit done. And then another very, very cute little t-shirt. This one has little roses all over it and I just thought it would look so nice in the summer with just light wash jeans so yeah I love this and it's also going to be really flattering because it's got like that little bit of ruching at the chest I then picked up a little knitted cardigan because I have a thing for cardigans at the moment like I really really like them <laughs> but this would look quite cute with this outfit I've got on at the moment actually unbuttoned or it looks good with joggers and like a little white tank top underneath so yeah I just thought it added a little bit of girliness to my loungewear I then picked up two hair accessories the first one is a little scrunchie I've lost count of the number of scrunchies I have from Brandy Melville because they're just so tempting but this one has little rosebuds on it and it's in like a thermal style fabric and then the next one I have is just a hairband. It's really hard to find nice headbands these days that 
are like thick enough to hold your hair in place and not slip everywhere. Um, this one's really nice. It is quite wide um, and my head doesn't seem to be accommodating of such wide headbands but <laughs> it does look cute. It's so good for days when I just want to do pattern cutting and I want my hair like completely out of my face or if I'm doing exercise and I want a headband on then it's perfect. Then from Topshop I have these joggers which are a really light yellow colour. Oh, I've just noticed they've got a stain on them. Not good. I haven't even worn these yet. My friend sent me the most disgusting video of things that get returned from Boohoo and sent out again, like um, stains and bodily fluids. So now every time I get online orders, I'm like, let's check everything. I already have a pair of joggers like this from Topshop, but they're in like a really, really light gray. Um, and I just thought the yellow was nice and happy and bright, so. Yeah, those are those. I think these are their like 90s style joggers. And then finally, I have a set that I got on Amazon and dyed myself. These were originally white. Um, so this is what the top looks like. Um, I might upload a tutorial of this. I haven't decided where I'm going to put the tutorial yet. Probably just on my Instagram. So if you're interested in how I did this, then check that out. Probably won't be up by the time this video goes up so you might have to wait for that. <laughs> but I'm kind of a little bit obsessed with the colour of these. The sweatshirt is size extra extra large so that it's nice and oversized and then I think these I bought in, these are size 12 to 14 actually, um, the joggers. So I sized up in those two. Um, and it just looks so cool as a set. So there we have it, that is my loungewear haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. At the start of lockdown, I was like, I'm not gonna give in to just wearing tracksuits every day, but I feel like everyone's just not given up, but given in to the comfy life. And I'm trying to make the comfy life look nice. I hope you guys are all having a great day and I will see you in my next video. Bye.